माई नेम इज वामशी एंड वेलकम टू माई चैनल लेट्स ई पार्ट टू ऑफ दी टर्की सीरीज इस्तानबुल हैज अ वेरी नाइस एंड स्ट्रेंज वेदर एट द सेम टाइम नाइस बिकॉज जनरली इट डजेंट गेट फ्रीज कोल्ड और हॉरिबली हॉट स्ट्रेंज बिकॉज इट कुड चेंज टू और थ्री टाइम एट द सेम डे फॉर एग्जाम्पल इट कुड बी सनी एंड वॉम एट द डे टाइम एंड टर्नस टू बी रेनी एंड कोल्ड इन द नाइट टाइम इट्स सेवन ए एम इन द मॉर्निंग एंड वी आर ऑफ टू हैव अवर ब्रेकफास्ट वी वेर इन सर्च फॉर सम इंडियन रेस्टोरेंट्स लाइक डेली दरबार इंडिया गेट रेस्टोरेंट एंड देर वॉज एन अलाद इन पाकिस्तानी रेस्टोरेंट ऑल ऑफ दम वेर क्लोज इन द मॉर्निंग दे वेर ओपन ओनली अराउंड आफ्टर ट्वेल्व पी एम टू अ लक वी फाउंड आउट ए स्मॉल रेस्टोरेंट विच वॉज बम्बी कैफे दिस टर्न आउट टू बी रियली गुड फॉर ब्रेकफास्ट वी गॉट सम वेजिटेरियन फूड अवेलेबल एज वेल यू कैन सी सम ऑफ द कॉस्ट ऑफ हियर The first thing in the morning was we visited the Hagia Trajana. This holy trinity is a Greek uh, Orthodox church uh, designed by Ottoman Greek architect P. Kampanaki, uh, completed in 1880. It is built in neo-baroque style with twin bell towers and a large dome. This church was damaged by fire during a mob attack against Istanbul's Greek minority in 1955. It was renovated in 2003 primarily out of a donation of uh, 90000 US dollars by the industrialist Angelo Polis. This church has exquisite uh, painting and sculptures and is worth a visit. Then we went to one of the famous uh, chocolate shop in this uh, Istikal uh, Kadesi street. I'm not sure how is it called uh, it is Balkai or Balki maybe you can put it in the comments uh, what exactly it is. Uh, this is one of the most tasty chocolate store, and I will definitely recommend it. The prices are reasonable, and uh, they have two branches of this shop on the East Calcutta Street Road. Then we also wanted to try some of the best uh, Turkish delights, uh, or Lokium, which is uh, which you can see the shop name is the Lokium City. Lokium is uh, basically a family of confections based on a gel of starch and sugar. Premium varieties consistently largely of chopped dates, pistas, hazelnuts, or walnuts bonded by the gel. It really was like a starch and a sugar gel, often containing uh, fruit or nuts and flavored with uh, uh, maybe a rose water, citrus, uh, a mint. The texture is gummy and sticky. Some of the flavors are uh, uh, really unfamiliar actually, uh, and the whole thing is very very sweet. Then we visited the most famous and the popular Madame Tussauds Wax Museum. We had bought the Istanbul tourist pass, uh, so the entry for us was the free. Uh, but if you are visiting uh, as a separately just uh, for this, uh, then the normal ticket value would be 15 euros per head. Uh, if you are really interested in taking selfies with the world most famous artists or the pop singers, if the answer is yes. Then uh, Madam Tussauds uh, Wax Museum in Istanbul would be the place to go. This museum has uh, wax models of uh, world famous people that you can see from really close. Uh, located uh, conveniently in the new city's heart, you can get public transportation to get to this fascinating museum. What you would see inside is world famous people and famous characters from the history of the Ottoman Empire and the Turkish Republic. Madam Tussauds Wax Museum is open every day between 11 a.m. to 8 p.m. The museum has five different sections: music, sports, history and leaders, film, and the VIP party. All the statues inside are done after a long study. This study includes lots of pictures and historical facts. There are one-to-one copies of the people or close to the historical records. You can see artists like Madonna, famous sportsmen like Muhammad Ali, or Rafael Nadal, actors such as Brad Pitt, Johnny Depp, and many more. If you like to be surrounded by the famous people. You will love Madam Tussauds Wax Museum. It makes you feels like a star yourself when you enter on a red carpet. How was your experience at Madam Tussauds? It was wonderful. So I felt like you Europeans never 
was a doll, but they were actually human. <laughs> there was uh, there was one thing like if we put our fingers on a ball, uh, the light would attract to the fingers. What did you like? Uh, it was really good. Actually, the mannequins they look real. Even she is a mannequin. No. <laughs> Bye. And uh, before you exit the museum, you can find this uh, small gift shop over there. Uh, here you can buy some uh, gift items, uh, some souvenirs. You can see this uh, little Oscar awards present here, uh, which are available for a very cheap price uh, and they are uh, reasonably having good quality as well. Uh, this museum is located in the Grand Para shopping mall. So after the museum visit, you can have some shopping time as well. Then in the afternoon, uh, we started our journey to Sea Life uh, Aquarium Istanbul. Uh, how to get there? Uh, take the M1A or the M1B metro line and get off at uh, Kokatapi uh, station. Inside the metro station, uh, uh, take the Forum Mall, uh, uh, Istanbul Mall uh, exit. Uh, the entrance to the aquarium is outside the mall. Let's check out the underwater world with Sea Life Aquarium here in Istanbul. Do keep a note of the timings, uh, it is 12 pm to 6 pm only. The regular ticket for an adult is around 12 euros per person. There is so much to see, learn and do at Sea Life uh, Aquarium. Uh, we can meet the largest collection of sharks, uh, sea whales, sea turtles and many more amazing sea creatures. You can even touch starfish and crabs in an interactive rock pools. Sea Life Aquarium provides an unforgettable experience to visitors with the fish and underwater species collected from 51 points in the world. It welcomes visitors for more than 40 years. The hundreds of species attract the attention of everyone from 7 to 70 in the Sea Life Aquarium. This includes sand tiger sharks as well. They are among the most interesting creatures of the aquarium with the first and only breeds in Turkey. Offering the chance to observe creatures from the great white shark family, the young children will definitely get fascinated by the underwater life here. The aquarium also includes other magical species such as uh, rock pools and jellyfishes as well. Uh, we have to walk through around 100 meters long uh, underwater ocean tunnel and admire the giant sea bed display and you will feel like you are under the ocean yourself. If you are a true nature enthusiast, you can immerse yourself from the oceans to the Amazon forest with the jungle. Uh, it is enough to spare about uh, 60 to 90 minutes to visit the entire aquarium and uh, examine all living things in detail. However, for more detailed trip and learning more about the animals, you need to set aside a longer period of time. We are back to the metro station and uh, we are going to our next venture to the Sapphire shopping mall. This mall can be reached by the metro and uh, we have to get off at the 411 and metro station. You can see this skyscraper uh, where only we can see half of the building, the other half of the building is in the sky. Uh, we are now going to that building. This shopping mall is open from 10 am until 10 pm every day. Last admission to the observation deck uh, which is 9 30 pm. We are now going to the observation deck. There are two things to experience in the shopping mall. The first one is a sapphire observation deck and the second one is a sky ride 4 day simulation. We will talk about the first one, the sapphire observation deck, which is one of the best places to visit in Istanbul with its magnificent bird's eye view of the top floor of the sapphire building. We can see a 360 degree angle view from where we can witness many different sites in the same place. We are here waiting in the queue just to get into the lift here. We can see that uh, there is a lot of crowd uh, with tourists just to visit this magnificent and modern structure. The luxury sapphire residence is a skyscraper with 54 floors and includes uh, sapphire shopping mall, sapphire observation deck and a golf course. Uh, we can see the lift. Uh, we are just reaching to the topmost 54th floor in just couple of minutes. This is the fastest ever lift I have climbed. 
let me know what is yours in the comment section uh, you can witness uh, the people here waiting for the skyride uh, 4d simulation uh, there's a lot of big queue. We uh, we will be witnessing that in uh, a few minutes after uh, watching the breathtaking view of the uh, 360 degrees view. Skyride is basically a helicopter ride uh, with a 4D simulation view where you can get a chance to view the entire Istanbul and learn all the historical culture of them. You can see that we are now, you know, witnessing uh, uh, the city at the 236 meter of the sapphire building we are almost in the clouds <laughs> at the top of the sapphire shopping mall uh, this observation deck offers uh, visitors a unique view and restaurants and entertainment services the temperature was under 10 and the wind was very fast we couldn't stay for much uh, longer than few minutes uh, maybe after a couple of pictures we had to leave that place let's look at some moments from the 4d sky ride please bear with the clarity as this is the 4d video Do you think it is worth visiting this place? Yes, yes, it was uh, worth the ride. I would say uh, we should go for it. So, Pawan, what did you like in that ride? Um, uh, there were clouds and when the helicopter went into the clouds, there came some smoke and uh, some kind of uh, water and I liked that. I had an amazing helicopter experience. Seeing all the places in the sun no one's very happy, excited. So, so what all places we covered today? First we went to church, which was a very, very good, different experience for us. Then after that we went to an excellent place, Madame Sussex. Okay. Then followed by Sea Lake Aquarium, that is also fantastic, especially kids enjoy a lot. Then uh, from there uh, we went to Sky Tower, okay, that is also awesome. Sky yeah. Tower and uh, we, two things we did in Sky Tower. Sky Tower, we did uh, two things. One is uh, ride, Sky Ride. Mm. That is Sky Ride, and uh, especially that Sky Tower, it, which is a 54 floors. 54 floors. Yeah, it was awesome. Mm. It, we were in clouds for some time. Mm. It was unfortunate that we couldn't see the entire view because of the clouds, because of the uh, fog, but uh, it was an awesome experience. We are extremely tired. Uh, our petrol is over actually. Gas is over, diesel is over, water. Natural energy is over. We are going to Taksim uh, to eat our dinner. It's already 9.30. Which hotel? Uh, Delhi Darbar or Indian Gate, whichever is open. Yeah, yeah. Let's try our luck. Stay tuned for the next part of the Turkey series. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please like, comment and subscribe.